All right, I'm gonna show you how to add multiple tasks at one time into Google Tasks. It's, it's gonna save you a lot of time. Open up your browser, go to Google Tasks, go to your space, I created a test space. And I'm gonna get go to add space task. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to my Google Doc, which has all of my tasks here, okay? And I have them all bullet pointed. I'm going to copy them. You don't have to have them bullet pointed, actually, because this will work either way. I'm going to copy them all and I'm going to paste them into one task. Okay, and then it says, this is going to create 25 tasks. Do you really want to continue? Well, actually, yes, that's exactly what I want to do. I'm going to hit OK and boom, there they all are, all at one time. This saves a bunch of time. I still have to go in and individually assign it and date it. Uh, if I, I don't have to date it, but if I want to, I can. Um, but all in, this saves a lot of time. Now, if it's bullet pointed, like I said, it will still work. I've noticed that if you're copying a list from um, Google Tasks, like a checklist from Google Tasks, or sorry, from like, if you're adding in a list from your Apple Notes, that's a, a, a task list, it will like kind of add this funky little, a funky few little characters at the beginning of it. Um, but it should work just fine, even if I'm pasting from, uh, yep, pasted just fine. Posting, pasting from, I can't speak, my goodness. P pasting from Google Docs. Anyway, one thing I recommend is create a bunch of workflows in one Google Doc. This is our workflow for onboarding independent contractors. You can create another, I could create another, uh, workflow for offboarding an independent contractor, or I could, do that for creating a website, whatever it is, I can create a bunch of workflows, copy it, paste it in here, boom, I'm done. I hope this was helpful. If it was, please like, subscribe, and share with your friends.